First, though, in just hours, local health care workers will get the first doses of that coronavirus vaccine in Central Florida. This is News 6 at 11. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. News 6's Nikki Zizaza is outside Advent Health in Orlando with what's next in the vaccine rollout. Advent Health has Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine in their freezers right now and say they are ready to administer doses to frontline workers who have opted to take the vaccine. Advent Health provided this video of the first batch of Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine arriving in FedEx trucks, then into these specialty freezers. Very exciting times. Doses Advent Health officials say will be injected into the arms of roughly 9,400 frontline workers. Our frontline team members will begin to receive their vaccines tomorrow, Wednesday morning, at both our Orlando and Celebration campuses. Governor Ron DeSantis addressing Floridians during a news conference in West Palm Beach and discussing the vaccine rollout. Today, Jackson Memorial in Miami, uh, as well as Advent Health in Orlando, received shipments. So they're all getting about 19,500 doses. The Food and Drug Administration giving emergency authorization to Pfizer's vaccine with plans to possibly do the same for a vaccine created by Moderna. So we anticipate by the end of this week, sometime over the weekend, we'll actually have an emergency use authorization for a second messenger RNA vaccine. Governor DeSantis says the vaccine will not be mandated, but he urges frontline workers directly involved with caring for COVID-19 patients to roll up their sleeves and take the vaccine. In the hospitals, uh, initially they had some takers and, and those takers are, are more because people have seen it done. Now, Advent Health officials say any remaining vaccine doses will be sent outside the Tri-County to areas like Lake County and Daytona Beach. Reporting in Orlando, Nikki Zizaza getting results, News 6.